What's up, Pac-Man? It's Will21, and this is a Minecraft mod install tutorial for Extra Biomes XL version 1.17. You might have seen this review done by Little Ethan. That review will be down in the, in the link will be down in the description below. This is how you install it. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to back up your Minecraft files. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to bottom left hand corner of the screen, you're going to click on the globe, and you're going to type in percent sign app data percent sign, and hit enter. What you do next is you're going to double click on the dot Minecraft folder. Everything within here, you're going to hit Control A to highlight everything, or click and drag, right click and choose copy. Next thing you do is you're going to right click on your desktop or your place of choosing, choose new folder, and type MC Backup or a name of you wish. Double click on it to open it up, right click in that folder, and choose paste. This will ensure everything is backed up, all your texture packs, your last login, you got a server.dat for your server information, your screenshots, all that fun stuff. Your saves, definitely saves, definitely very important. Okay, once it's done, you can close out of the backup. Next thing you do is you can go back to your dot .minecraft, dot .minecraft folder, highlight everything. I'm going to do everything except for last login. And I'm going to hit delete. It's going to remove everything within the dot .minecraft folder. You can keep that open. Next thing you do is you're going to launch Minecraft. You're going to log in. Once it after it logs in, it's going to update Minecraft, which means it's going to re-download all the Minecraft files. Once it's done, it's going to re just verify that it's Minecraft version 1.2.5. Again, this is for a clean install. This will remove all their mods that you're currently running. You'd have to check the forum post to see what it's compatible with or what specific order you have to install it if it does have the information about as far as if it's compatible with other mods. Once it says Minecraft 1.2.5, we can close out of Minecraft. Next thing we're gonna do, I use 7-zip for the archiving program. You can use WinRAR. You'd have to figure out on your own of how it works, but this is for 7-zip and it's a free application. Link's down below. In the job Minecraft folder, you're gonna have a bin folder. You're going to double click on that bin folder. You're going to right click on the Minecraft file and choose 7-zip and then open archive. The first thing we're gonna do is you're going to click on the meta-inf folder once to highlight it and hit delete on your keyboard. Make sure you want to delete. Yes, need to delete that folder. Again, the link down below is for the extra biomes Excel forum post. Once you scroll down, I'm going to first show you how to install Minecraft for Minecraft version 1.2.5. that requires mod loader and forge. Those links are on the page, but you can also do it for classic, which means it does not need any pre reservoir mods required but we're going to do the first we're going to do this one which is, requires mod loader and forge again that link for the forum post is in the description below i have everything downloaded right here first thing we do is we're going to install mod loader so after you delete the meta dash inf you can do is you're going to right click on the mod loader zip choose seven zip and open archive i'm going to put these side by side you're going to hit Control a in the mod loader so we can highlight all of these files you're going to click and drag these dot class files to the other dot class files in the minecraft.jar and drop it off and hit yes. Do not, I repeat, do not drop them off in any subfolder within minecraft.jar. It will crash Minecraft. Once that's done, mod loader is installed. We can close out a mod loader zip. Next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna right click on the Minecraft Forge zip, choose seven zip and open archive. Now, same thing within here. You're going to hit Control A just to ensure that everything is highlighted. Click and drag them to the right hand side where the other dot class fire files are in Minecraft.jar. Drop it off. You're going to hit Yes. Once that's complete, Minecraft Forge is installed. We can close out of the Minecraft Forge zip. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to right click on the Extra Biomes XL zip that you downloaded. This is for the top one. You're going to see a jar files folder. You're going to double click on that and you're going to see a whole bunch of class files within here. You're going to hit control A on your keyboard to highlight everything within here. You're going to click and drag all these wonderful files to the right hand side where the other dot class files are. You're going to drop it off. You're going to hit yes. Once it's complete, everything's installed. If we can close out of the zip, we can close out of Minecraft.jar. 
And now we can launch Minecraft. <coughs> We're gonna launch Minecraft. We're going to log in. Now I'm not sure if this will add into your previous worlds. You probably will have to create a new world because this adds extra blocks to the game. So we're gonna go to single player, we're gonna create a world. We're gonna go creative. We're just gonna create one right off the bat. Once everything's good, we're gonna go around it really quick. Uh, it's gonna add a whole bunch of other biomes to this. Again, the mod review link will be annotated on the screen also down in the description below that little Ethan did. We should have the blocks within here if they're the new ones. Oh, look, yep. Look at the different grasses, autumn saplings. We should have some new, like different types of leaves. Just seeing really quickly if what other if there's any other types of blocks. I think there are some other types of blocks too. Different sandstones. We already have. We already know about those. I'm gonna see really quickly if oh, that's a cool landscape. That's uh, interesting. <laughs> We'd have to adventure around a bit. Also, wait till everything loads. A frozen river. Oh, look at these trees. Ah, oh, just like the normal pine. Ooh, look at this. Different type of man. Those trees are high. Cool. Again, that's how to that's how to install the extra biomes one that uh, that requires the mod loader and the forge. Wow, this jungle biomes on above the trees. That's crazy. Again, the whole review for the mod link I said it will be down in the description below. Also, be annotated on the screen. This is cool. All right, now we'll do the install for the non-modded version like so you don't you don't need mod loader or forge so i'm gonna do is i'm gonna exit out of this save and quit close minecraft i do not want to back up this so what you do is you go back to your dot minecraft folder the bottom left hand corner of the screen you get the globe type in percent sign app data percent sign and then hit enter go into your dot minecraft folder we've got everything within here which actually i'm going to do is i'm going to highlight everything except for last login I'm going to delete. I'm going to relaunch Minecraft. I'm going to log in. It's going to re-download Minecraft. You will need 7-Zip for this, or WinRAR, if you know how to use that application. 1.2.5, clean version. Go into your bin folder. Right-click on Minecraft.jar. 7-Zip, open archive. Delete the meta-inf. Next thing you do is you're going to right click on the Extra Biomes Classic version, which actually it's 1.15, seven zip open archive. All you're gonna see in here is a bunch of class files in here. All you do is highlight all of these and click and drag them over to the right hand side to the other dot class files are. You drop it off. Once that's done, you can close out of the classic zip, also minecraft.jar. We can go back into Minecraft and this is just a classic version. This is more of a vanilla feel. It does not add extra blocks, just more landscapey worlds or biomes in that sense. <coughs> Once it generates, it'll be done. And then we should have some pretty cool landscapes and such. Like this random These random hills over here. Usually not that usually not that hilly. 
Cool, that's how to install the extra Biomes XL and also the classic version. If this has helped you out, make sure you leave a like down below. Also like comments. Also check out the mod review, the full mod review by Little Ethan. My name is Wolf21, and as always, remember to rock on.